Hi, welcome to Shikhan.com. In our today's question and answer session, we will answer some of your questions. And the question is that how he can hide some rows and columns from a certain document. For example, if you want to hide some columns under header, then how we can hide the certain rows and the certain columns from our particular document. So in today's video, we are going to solve this query that how we can perform this function in Excel document. If you guys haven't subscribed to our channel, then do subscribe to our channel and don't forget to like and share. So let's start with today's class. The documents which is visible in the screen. In our documents, we have created one heading section. In every document, there is a heading which is being provided by some content under it. So here we have some headings like name, mobile, email, which has some more content under it. So if we want to hide some rows in this, like we learned in our previous classes, we simply can select our row and click on the right button. And from here, we can press on hide. So now our row will be disappeared. So how can we bring it back? We will just select these two rows. Then we will right click and press on hide. Then our row will appear again on our screen. We have to use hide and unhide function in lots of documents. Suppose if we want to send any documents. So in that case, sometimes we need to hide some of the rows and columns while printing or sending any documents to any client. So in that case, instead of deleting the row, we can just hide the row and click on print. Or we can save as PDF and send to the client or whoever we want to send it. Now, if any user wants to construct a proper heading, for example, in any documents, we want to make our mobile as our heading but I don't want to provide any content in that. Basically, I want to hide all of this here. So now what we need to do for hiding all this content or any particular cell, first we need to select that place which we want to hide. While selecting, we will not select the heading because we don't want to hide the heading. After selecting in the right side of the cell option, you can find an option named format. Let's click on format. Then if we come downwards, we will find an option named visibility. After that, we will go to hide and unhide option. In this, we will go to the first option that is hide rows and then click here. Here we will notice that previously while hiding, at the time our entire section got disappeared including the heading. But now after hiding, our heading remains constant. But our content inside has got disappeared from the screen. So how we can bring back our hidden content? If we drag this from here and we want to say work here, so sometimes it gets disappeared and sometimes it arrives. For example, if we want to unhide the row, still we can see our content has not appeared. So for bringing back the hidden file, one thing we can do is to select everything including the headings. After that, we will go back to format and then we will go and select on unhide row. Then we will notice all our hidden rows and columns starts to appear again on our screens. Now, if you want to hide any particular cell from your document, then it is not possible to hide any particular cell in that way. For example, if you want to hide just the mobile number, say you want to hide all your content under the mobile number. So if we select our content that we want to hide, we will go to format. And if we click on hide columns, then we can see the work we did from the top by right clicking that format has been applied here. So let's undo this. So we have learned that if you want to hide any particular cell, then we can go to format, hide and unhide option. But from there, we cannot hide and unhide. So for doing that, we can apply another tricks. That is, for example, if we click on these three numbers and right click, then we go to format cells. After going there, we will directly go downwards and go to custom. After going to custom, we will see that in place of type, general is given. If we put any numbers apart from this format here, or else, if we give colon, for example, if we give three colons, which is not been included in any format, then we will press OK. Then we will notice that our content has been disappeared. But on the above, you will get all the values. Now we can go to print format, print preview. Then we will notice the content which are on a mobile number. All those content has got disappeared. So in this way, if we want, we can hide any cells content using some tricks in MS Excel. Though we cannot do this officially in MS Excel, 
In the same way, if we want our data back, then we will go and select general from the top. So we will notice that all our data has come back on the screen. So this was for today's class. I hope the one who raised this question that he wanted to hide a particular cell. If you want to hide the entire cell, then we have shown the process here. Or if you want to hide any particular cell from any particular document, then you can go to format cell and by using some tricks, you can hide it in MS Excel. Thank you everyone for being in this question and answer session. If you guys face any problem, then do let us know in our comment section. Or else you can message us in our Facebook page, facebook.com slash Or you can even comment on our forum in forum.shikhan.com. You can visit our site and solve all your queries there. Wishing you all a good day and thanks for watching.